it means a lot to have a good instrument. I love instruments. I collect guitars because I love them. I love them. It's not so bad, huh? I was a Boy Scout, and um, when I was 12 years old, so 1964-ish, uh, I set the record for selling the most boxes of Boy Scout cookies. I made $24.20, and my father threw in 80 cents, and I bought my first guitar. Well, people collect cars, people collect stamps, people collect coins, I mean, why do they do it? They do it for a passion. This has been my passion as a child. You know, this is my passion going back to, you know, 10, 11 years old. So um, to own these guitars, to have them, to appreciate them, it's like art, sculpture, furniture. You know, I'm a curator of this stuff. I love it. You know, I'm 16, 17, 18 years old, so I'd go to the Fillmore East, our concert hall. Downtown, you could see every band you want. Hendrix, Led Zeppelin, Grateful Dead, John Jefferson Airplane, Janis Joplin, Crosby, Stills, Nash, <coughs> The Who, Pink Floyd, they all played at this theater. So you could live your dream. So I would go see them. I'd come home in front of the mirror, and I'd go, ah, and pretend I was a star. Ah. That was the beauty of the time that I grew up in. And I eventually dropped out of school in my senior year of high school, which really upset my mom. She said to me, what you? she said, you got two months, two months to graduate. I said, screw it. And she said, what are you gonna do? And I said to her, don't worry about me, I'm gonna become a rock star. I had no idea what the hell I was saying. Ironically, my mom died in 74 when the band was in its infancy, so she never had a clue. And, and of course, Twisted Sister is, has been a passion for 40 years, will continue to be, because I'm proud of our legacy. I'm proud that we worked as hard as we worked. I mean, more so than all this, was how many years of my life, sweat and, sweat and tears, blood, sweat and tears I put into. much more of a machine sounding guitar, you know, much more metal. So that's what makes it perfect for me. I don't think I'm that talented, so I'm one of those guys who will tell you that I have this much talent and have that much drive. And because my successes were driven by my desire and my ability to see large pictures. But I would say most, for the most part, it's tons of hard work. This is New York. Passion is what drives you. Passion is the pool with which you dip into during the crises points because if you don't have the passion, you'll never get through the, the disasters. And you'll never get through the rejections. And the bowl of passion is only so deep. And then hopefully you'll make it before the passion runs out because that's what fuels you. <laughs>